of weeks ago, I got these base plates from someone that I knew who was selling them. She reached out and said that she was a reseller for joint cakes and asked me if I wanted to give them a try. So I bought the base plates and they were amazing. Oh my god, they are so sturdy. And the kids play with them every single day, they love it. Then I decided that I was going to get one set of joint picks for her because uh, Michaela was like uh, trying to build something on the floor the other day and then she ran out of tiles and then she said she needed more. Basically, I bought the generic ones of Lazada and I've recommended them to so many people because I feel like for the price compared to like Connect Connect Picks, and what have you not, all the other brands. Um, they serve its purpose. So in terms of like construction and play, like they do really well and I have so much of love for them because I've had them for years. I've had them for over two years. I got the Art Mac uh, pre-loved though. I got them on Carousel. I didn't really know whether they were going to compare, like how they were going to compare to the generic ones. Um, so I got them pre-loved but I did decide to get the joint picks and see how they go against the other ones because the base plate was really like, I was pretty impressed by the base plate. I love it. So I've got the generic brand and then I've got the art mag and uh, let me just grab a purple one from Jointix. They don't feel very much different. They're pretty much identical in terms of size. The magnet size... The magnet size is also... It looks the same to me. I'm just going to see how they stand up against each other. So when um, Nara first started playing with these, she, I've had these since um, before she was born and so she's been around them basically since birth but when she started playing with it was when she was about 15 months or so right about now like about Enzo's age he's, he's pretty much experimenting with them as well so she used to do this to try and build um, not all the time that would work out sometimes it would fall like that but she used to basically do this because she didn't know how to line it up like that like Michaela already knew how to do that so um, one of the earlier tiles that I had let me see if I still have them on okay, so this is another generic brand that I got this was the first ones that I ever got and they are oh my gosh they are so awful like they were they just they, they were very frustrating um, you know, it took a couple of, of times to do that and most of sometimes like you would really have to line it up in order to get it to stand but a lot of times like if you're a baby like if you're a toddler just trying it out like and it doesn't you know it doesn't stand like it she used to get so frustrated and it used to really piss her off so this was this is also a generic one that I also got off of Lazada so if you're gonna get a generic brand just be aware that you want to get a good one um, they, they are to grab um, one that is easy to see. In terms of magnet size, uh, you have to be really careful when you're getting generic brands because you don't know what you're going to get. So this one, the magnets are significantly smaller. Like you can see, they're much thinner than this. This is the joint text one, and these are very similar to the current. Um, current genetic one, uh, gen generic ones that I have but these generic ones that I have they are very they're very thin like the magnets and they're very frustrating um, so yeah so if you're gonna get generic ones you that, that's the only thing you have to really be very careful uh, where you're getting it from who you're getting it from because of, of that like you won't know like I feel I got really lucky with these generic ones so I've ordered them a few times already i think i've ordered like three or four times Nicola's current session right now is the rainbow so with the generic ones even with these ones like i only got four colors of these so i'm never again gonna buy from that person but i did get five colors of this um this seller with the art mag you get six colors so i don't get an orange from here and even with the big squares that I buy, I, I only get, so he he has red and blue, but every single time that I've purchased, they'd, they'd always say like, um, blue is out of stock, blue is out of stock, so I have so many, I do believe that if you buy a bigger set for joint picks, you also get uh, different colours, because they gave me two different colours with the starter set. Okay, that's, that's a generic brand.
the department. I'm gonna try that again with these two. Really slowly. Okay. Ah, that's a generic one. <laughs> okay. Then if you already have a generic one and you just want to add on and get the joint ticks or whatever they they all they build really well like they still work really well but like i was saying um when my kids were little and just starting out where enzo currently is right now and he's doing the same thing he's basically doing like like that and it's falling over and stuff so if your kid's gonna be like that i guess having something that will stand of course that happened but something that will more likely stand and fall is going to be less frustrating but um for some reason it seems like as if the bigger squares are better though even though like i i still feel like maybe the magnets i don't know if you can see but they ever so slightly bigger than the generic ones so maybe that's why they, they stand better. The size of the tile itself, the art mag is bigger, the joint ticks is slightly smaller but still bigger than the generic one. The joint ticks with the generic one and they'll build just fine. I'll show you. Let's just grab the small one. And they build fine. They, they built just as well. Uh, they go well together. Basically, they're pretty compatible with, with each other. It's just that if you're going to get them, like if you have a generic one or if you already have one particular brand, just know that the sizes will be different. My kids don't care though. Like They don't even notice the difference. So I, I opened it up for them just now and let them have a go at it. They were playing with it outside and they were just using all the pieces. Well. My other generic brand. Oh, no. so, it's just when if you do decide to get generic brands, just make sure that you're getting a good magnet. And before I got these from Michaela, uh, what was popular back then or what I knew. Um, based on videos that I, I used to watch on like toys to get for children the magnet tiles were always were, were really popular like that kept coming up on youtube and stuff like that magnet tiles so i tried to look for magnet tiles but they are so expensive like kid you not expensive and then i couldn't get them anywhere here in malaysia and i went to singapore and i found them but um Shamis was like, no, we're not paying for that. That's crazy. Um, so when we came back, uh, I think connect connecti connectics connect how how do you pronounce it? Okay, so we we connectics was um was was coming into Malaysia at that time. Um, but connectics also pretty expensive, and Shamis was still like, no. So then I went on Lazada, and it just popped up like this once popped up on on my feet on my thing whatever so i bought them i bought them and she loved it like she loved it so much and i wanted to buy another one bought it by chance and it was so much better and i got another set so after i got the other set um the only thing that i was quite like you know about was the fact that they didn't have orange i used it with with other toys a lot so i use it a lot for color sorting 
and uh, we built like an uh, orange one and you know and with all the colors and stuff and then I would pop them get them to pop them into the right colors here and there and without the orange tile it's obviously hard to do a sorting with orange color um, but if you're talking about just building alone like solely building without doing all these other things the generic brand will last you a really long time. I've had them for over two years and they are so loved, like so, so loved. But based on aesthetics alone, I will say they are so pretty. They're really, really nice. In the sun, when you're playing with it, like they shine, they're so beautiful. Uh, these generic ones are obviously a little bit more dull. If that doesn't bother you, like it didn't bother my kids at all, I would say the generic one for the price I wrote it down somewhere. For, I got this whole set for like less than 80 if I'm not mistaken. Uh, pretty love. So I got this 58 piece set for 100 and 179. The generic ones, they go for 109 for 70 pieces and 158 for 113 pieces. I when I first bought them, they were a lot, a lot cheaper. I think I got like a hundred something for only 90 ringgit at the time. So they've been getting a little bit more expensive. Anyway, if you want to know where I got the generic ones, I will send you the link. Just let me know. Um, I can also let you know who the reseller is for the joint takes. Let me know if you want that too. I know that you can get Artmac off of Lazada, but I'm just not so sure that like how I feel about this is like fair and accurate simply because it is pre-loved. I don't know if a brand new one would work differently. Just putting that up there. I don't know what it's like. You know when Ellie Wong said, do you watch stand-up comedy? When she said like how she gravitates towards like sparkly shoes to compensate for the light that has died in her life. Like that's how I'm feeling about these right now. Like I'm gravitating towards the prettiest stuff. <laughs> Even though these are so much cheaper. So if I had to look around and see and feel like as if a unicorn just like threw up a hill, at least I feel nice, you know, looking at the prettiest stuff. So there's an activity that I'm going to do with the kids tomorrow involving colour and shapes. Um, so it, it, it's great that I do have the orange option. Um, but like I said, the generic brand looks fine. Which one do you want to do? I want to do a rainbow. <laughs> I want to do a rainbow too. I want to do a rainbow too. <laughs>